is next? I'm gonna get a phone call. Okay, I guess they want some Michael mission. Let's go to Michael. I wish I'm so sick of these FIB guys. Dave Norton is just kind of there. He doesn't. I don't really care about him. But Steve Haynes has to go. He is so annoying. Could they have popped him in the suburbs? Uh, Lamar, he's just a clueless dumb fuck. I don't. He doesn't need to die, but he's just stupid, and I don't want to hang out with him like ever again. Uh, I do like that they kept this the car that we stole last time we were using Michael. <laughs> That's kind of a nice uh, detail. It doesn't... I don't like this car. Yeah, I was gonna say that this car isn't mine anyway, so you know what? It's all right. You made it. Good. I saved you again, Davy. Again. So what are you gonna do for me about Haynes, the rest of the FIB, the IAA, and everyone else, huh? History's written by the living, okay? We can pin most of it on Agent Sanchez. I get that story right and the agency and bureau will back off. The problem we need to deal with is Trevor. Trevor? Why? Try Merriweather, Chinese gangsters, general insanity, and so on. I can spin Steve that you're controllable, but not Trevor. Steve? He's our wounded hero right now. I gotta cozy up to him. Calm him down. Just get me out. I'd rather take out Steve than Trevor, to be honest. I'm just throwing that out there. Hey, it's that yellow truck. I remember that truck. Tried to steal it. Buy a tuxedo? We have that in multiple colors. How does one buy a tuxedo? See you at the gym next week. Is this the tuxedo rack? Tuxedo, ten thousand dollars. Wow. Okay. Thank you. That's quite a bit of money. Luckily, I have a lot. I don't know what would happen if I didn't have money on me at the moment. That would be terrible because you'd have to like farm for ten thousand dollars, which would suck. But okay. We... I paid this guy to drive us. Get in the back. I like my car better though. Vinewood Boulevard, the Oriental Theater. Open that champagne, Jimbo. Hey, it's Michael's favorite song. Me and the big dog getting our drink on. Hey, hey, where are you going with that? Woo, my dad's a movie producer. Jimmy, get back down here. Which makes me a movie producer's kid. Jimmy. I'm going to ride out the next two recessions without ever having to work. And I'm going to get a sports car and a drug habit before appearing on Reality Rehab Show. And then I'm going to sell my story and become really judgmental. And I'm going to use all the contacts I make in treatment programs to become a producer, too. And... I'm gonna make even shittier movies than my dad does. Cause I don't care about movies like him. For me, it's just an opportunity thing. The fuck Woo! is he talking yeah. about? You see the streets edge loser? He didn't even stop. Chisel in the movie bizzle. Hear that Vinewood? You hear that Vinewood? I take it back. I think this is Franklin's trailer song. Hey, I hear it and I don't like it. We're going to the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. Get back down here. And not to, like, gawk at celebrities from behind a barrier. We're actually, like, properly invited. V to the I to the P. Jimmy! Read my neck rolls. Entitled. E-N-T. Uh, titled. And what? Because <sighs> I am. Jimmy! Oh, Pop Chill. I'm done spraying this shizzle. Let's take a drink. What Jimmy, you want? shut up a second. Hey, Devin, look. I need to say about Molly, man. I'm sorry, but I didn't do it. I told you to slow it down, slick. It was an accident. I was there, but I had nothing to do with it. Sure, yeah, hey. You made a fool out of me, Michael, and that is something I'm not gonna forget. Look. 
Devin. I said I'm sorry. I feel bad for you, but you don't threaten me, because this movie's happening, all right? So let's just calm down and try to be friends again. Oh, absolutely. Check it out. It's a premiere. Wow, there's like no one here. Cool. Well, thank you, Jim. Where are the girls? Uh, they're at home. You know, they'll uh, express their pride by showing up really late. Uh, of course they will. And uh, have you ever uh, thought maybe I shouldn't shoot sex scenes in a green screen? Oh, look who it is. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, the thought has uh, crossed my mind, I suppose. Thanks, Antonio. Give me nice and tight. Never... Hey, it's Laszlo on the red carpet of Meltdown. Some big stars, some beautiful dresses. We're going to see some side food tonight. Come on. We did it! Solomon! We fucking did it! Fucking A! <laughs> Fuck you, fate! I may be a lecherous old has-been, but I'm a has-been with a premiere at the Oriental Theater on Vinewood Boulevard. <clears throat> I'll see you in there, kid. Hey, thanks. Enjoy the picture, everyone! Mr. Richards! Mr. Richards, hi. If I could just bother you for a second. Um, I'm Laszlo from uh, Fame or Shame, um, but I do some acting on the side. I was wondering if... Uh... Oh, yeah, of course. You should come see me, kid. I think I got a project that would be perfect for you. Oh, that's fantastic. It's called The Closet. Huh? Really modern stuff. <laughs> Pervert. <laughs> come on. No, 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 no. Let's go over She's here. lying, okay? I never had surgery. Come Milton, on. Milton, Milton, hi. Sorry to bother you. Quick question. Get in here tight. Um... Love, love, loved the movie. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. When, when you were that polar bear and you had to eat your baby, I mean, that okay. was... Okay. All right, Jesus Christ. That was emotional. Stick and I just have a okay. hug. That really affected me. All right, I gotta go. Thank you so much. Excuse me. The Excuse fuck? me. Come on. Come on, let's get in there. Ah, Laszlo. Oh, shit. Come on, shit dick. <laughs> <laughs> Where the hell is she? Looks like she stood you up. Hey, hope I'm not too late. I wouldn't miss this for the world. Devin, the fuck are you doing here? Hey, what a movie, huh? Meltdown. Congratulations, Mikey. We did it. Hey, let's get a picture, huh? You, me, the proud producer. Such a pleasure working with you. You see, I was here. Unlike your wife. Seems to be stuck at home. <laughs> you twisted fuck. You're a dead man. Let's go, Jim. Come on. The girls are in danger. We gotta get to the house. Oh, you crashed me. This is a nice car. What happened? I don't know. This rich asshole is pissed off at me because I didn't shit can the movie. And then his lawyer died, and, and he just told me he's gonna hurt your mom. You killed his lawyer? And now he's gonna kill mom and Tracy? He ain't gonna do anything if I got a say in it. But you fucking killed his lawyer? No, I didn't. It was an accident. I would never do anything to put you in danger. Shit. All right. Okay. They'll be fine. They're tough. This is just a movie guy, right? He he's not a gangster or anything. No, he's not a gangster. He's just extremely rich. He says he's got all these connections. I'm sure it's just talk. Probably sent the mafia after us. We're gonna get there. Shit, what's that car? All right, Jimmy, you keep that guy just like yourself concealed. I'll go get the girls. You gotta save them, huh? Oh shit, Sherlock. Daddy's home, you prick! Ah, one of them's in with Tracy. We gotta get in there, Michael. He's in there with our girls. Mom, Daddy! Ah, ah, it's Rosie. No, no, okay. Really? Stay here. Keep your heads down. Be safe, baby. Don't you worry about me. We are a bullet sponge. Clear the building! No one leaves! <laughs> what, so he's in charge of Meriwether? Frag out! Nice frag. Not really. Not yet! Stay put! Neither do I. Just keep calm. Ah! 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 
I'm fine. Trace, just stay down, sweetie. No one's gonna kill you. Daddy's got this. Come on. Switch body armor. Get off my counter. Who's next? Carlos is our gardener. <laughs> oh, our nice tuxedo is getting fucked up right now, and it's not cool. There's an enemy over here. Where is it? That actually went rather well. I took only like a few bullets. What? Trace! Amanda! I think. Ouch. Got you, dick. Uh, oh, you all right? <laughs> no, it's not. What was that? Someone there? Oh, I'm gonna no. start shooting. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you like that, don't you, huh? Take it off. <laughs> oh. Get the oh. fuck off me. <laughs> I, I thought I was on that guy. <laughs> So you sit on his face? It's called teabagging. I really fucked him up good, though, huh? All right, listen, I'm gonna make a call. It's all gonna be okay. Stay put. <clears throat> yeah, that went well, I think. Tier one operator. I don't know what that means. 12 headshots, maybe? Probably. I don't know. They came to my house, Lester. My house! So I asked Amanda and the kids to move out for a few days. I hate to say it, but Meriwether isn't short on excuses to come and kill you. Nor does Devin Weston. I ain't looking for perspective, Lester. They came after my family. All right, right. I, I don't know what to say. Does this change where you stand on the Union Depository? Nope. Hell no. We move on that right away. Before it gets any hotter. That's smart. Uh, meet me at the strip joint. I'll get word to Frank and Trevor. Alright. Looks like we're getting ready to go to the heist. Well, I'm just gonna see what the mission criteria was for it. I'm just curious. Yeah, headshots, top speed. Yeah, okay. I got it. We are almost done, I think. 